How's it going, you guys? So, welcome back to yet another car, uh, cars, cars review and continue my. Oh my god, why won't this camera stay focus? <sighs> this camera will not stay focus. Oh, okay, there we go. Anyways. <laughs> I need to focus on the image. So, anyways, to continue my roster of the evolution of Lion McQueen, there's something that I did forget to do, and that is that talk about the Dynaco Lightning McQueen. Now, now this is um, let's see, there we go. Anyways, um, this looks wow, this looks so much better. The light looks very much better now. I'm filming in the daytime, but with multiple lights on. So yeah. So yeah, without further ado, let's begin this review on Dynaco Lightning McQueen. So this is the this is basically the regular Lightning McQueen, but this is like his imagination of like him taking that Dynaco sponsor to. It was like a scene in the movie where the King in the Cars one movie where the King is like talking to him, and he's thinking about him getting the Dynaco sponsorship and. The, yeah, this is how he imagines himself as the new Dynaco racer. So, so yeah, this was so yeah, this was actually released. Um, I don't really think it's that easy to find anymore. Oh, well, I'm not so sure about this. There is another Dynaco McQueen, which is in fact a um. How you say this? Um. There's another Dynaco McQueen that uh. That has him transforming from into it. And you know that scene where he like transforms, you know, from regular McQueen to Dynaco McQueen. Yeah, I think that's yeah, there is a transforming McQueen, which um I was telling um I was telling Sal, um, the Essos Hunters that um this is not really um release anymore or um that that's not really released anymore. So, yeah, um, yeah, just basically because they just cleared out the main line of Cars, of main Cars diecast, you know, from Cars 1 and Cars 2, but, uh, I don't know, I, I think I maybe could be Ron Sal, because, well, um, because, uh, they could be still, they could be still one out there, I mean, you, I mean, like, I'm mean, like, maybe you could check to his Toys R Us or something like that, I don't know. But, eh, whatever. So, yeah, without further ado, let's just go over the the car. So, he's painted all blue, but instead he has the Dynaco logo up top. The lightning bolt on the side. Uh, light, the light year tires, you know. This is my this is my old model, so it's pretty, it doesn't roll all that well anymore. The 95 logo right there. The lightning bolt. Uh, traced in with red, Dynaco logo right there, and then the light, and then the Lane McQueen signature up there. Look, ninety five again. On the back, he does have um the the fake the fake the fake headlights. Uh, I can't say it. fake number ninety five right there. And it says in Di and it says Dynaco right there. So yeah, looking pretty good for the most part. Now let's move on to another version of McQueen. This is where well he goes to where he goes really a bit crazy, and that is that he has his light year tires replaced with replaced with these silver piston cup wheels to like kind of indicate that he is in fact a piston cup champion so that is pretty cool right there so these two are the exact same but there's one big difference and that is that he has the dynamical logo right here on this spoiler and this one doesn't i don't really know what what's the deal with that now same thing with the regular mcqueen there are some models where he doesn't have the rusty's logo you know like I don't know why that is, but um I don't know what that is, but um it's kind of it's really kind of oh wait, there is another difference though. 
there is a lightning bolt. There, they has all. He has like a white lightning bolt, and he has a gray lightning bolt. So, yeah. So yeah. Ah, uh, really piece of tape. So, anyways, there you guys have it. There is my review of the cars of Dinoco McQueen. This is really kind of a short part. This is. So yeah, I so this concludes part two, and in part three ish, we'll go from there. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and to be continued.